Hey guys, and welcome back. This is Chosen Architect, and today we're going to be making some dark steel armor. Alright guys, so today we are going to get into some dark armor. I would really love to just make a set of dark armor, and I don't know if we can get it empowered in this episode, but we are definitely going to make some. So, um, let me go ahead, and like we're getting out of the way of the quests and stuff, I just... I can't really adventure out very far um, with the current armor I have. As you can see, yeah, hardly any at all. Um, and I don't want to make diamond armor because I just feel that that's not necessary. Um, we can use diamond for other things. Um, so I think that my best bet will be to make some dark steel armor. So we're going to need 24 obsidian. And I think the recipe for dark steel... Let's take a look at dark steel. I'm pretty sure it's the same. Okay, so it looks like coal powder, carbon dust, any coal dust, and one iron. So we're gonna need 24 iron, 24 coal dust. So 24 coal dust, um, 24 iron. We're gonna be using a lot of iron for this, but it's well worth it. We'll be able to find a lot more iron. And the obsidian. Now the obsidian is the only thing that we're going to need to actually get. And that's actually pretty easy to get, so I'm not too concerned about that. Because our obsidian is going to be right here. So, there's our obsidian. And if we have to go get more lava, which we might, 16 buckets of lava in here. Um, I'll just go get the, go get the lava. Yeah, I'll be right back once I get all of the obsidian we need. All right, and this is actually our last piece of obsidian that we're going to need. Look at that. One bucket left. Just about. Um, yeah, so we have everything we need. The only thing I'm I'm hoping we have enough of is power. Um, so we're going to have to definitely power some stuff. I went ahead and connected these guys up. And yeah, it totally doesn't have enough power to power... Four of these guys, and they all need 800,000 RF apiece. I just don't have that kind of power yet. But we'll fill it up with some power and get some. Um, by the way, um, in between episodes... Yeah, they broke into my base. Um, I guess Hero Brian managed to dig through here. I don't know exactly how he managed to get through it that fast. Um, but yeah, they mined through that, that and got in here, and it was attacking my dog. And he killed them all. This guy, this little guy is powerful. I wish I had a bunch. I could make a wolf army. And I wouldn't have to worry about it. But yeah, he, he definitely took a hit on his armor. I'd like to get him to diamond armor eventually. Um, he'd be really powerful. A good guy to take with me. Because um, it looks like he can take them out pretty fast. But let's go ahead and throw this in here. Alloys only. And we will throw this all in there. And it's going to use quite a bit of power and take quite a while to do this. While we're working on that um, there is a few things that we're going to need later on um, and that is with Ender IO um, we're going to need to go ahead and get a enchanter which requires dark steel in itself so um I mean, we're going to need this. We're going to need an enchanter. Um, I think that's the only way we're going to be able to get... Well, actually, no. We just need an anvil. So, an anvil. Just a regular anvil just requires a lot of iron. Okay. So... And steel. Okay, so we do have an iron. And we can just keep trying this method to get some iron. Like, it should net us, like, a few each time. And we should be able to, like, ex like grow... It's given us eight, and we only use six to make it, so it is doubling. 
but let's see. That's slow. It's a really slow process. Um, what we can do is take some of our other stuff that we have, I guess, and grind it down. Um, this guy's cooking along. I would like to get some power in it, though. Oh, you probably using some coal. I mean, I don't want to use all of our coal. Like, we're really low on coal, and like the only way to get coal is to go out adventuring. Um, so, to do that would be a waste, but... Let, let's check our dark armor. I, I've already forgotten what it takes to actually get this thing started. So we need a vibrant crystal. And ten levels. That's just to get it to empower level one. Okay, so... Ten, like, levels is something that we don't currently have a lot of. And breeding really is not getting us anywhere with levels. Um, so we're probably going to have to bust into our, our our reserve. Right here, our bottle of enchanting reserve. And uh, hopefully that'll give us enough levels to actually get this guy up and running. But yeah, we're going to need some steel. And some iron. So I'll be right back after I get a little bit more iron. And uh, hopefully our other stuff will be done. And then we can get going. So this is actually done. We have our 24 dark steel ready to go. Um, I went ahead and got some more power going. Um, and also got a lot more iron. I went ahead and just kept making iron. Um, but we now have iron. So we have a lot of iron to spare. Unfortunately, like that, that's the only, uh, only one that lets you do that. Because you can't break down tin bars. You can only break down iron bars for some reason. Um, but we do have that, so I'm guessing that uh, that's something that we can do. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and turn that on. We're going to cook up a li little bit more. Oh, actually, I wanted to cook my fish. There we go. Yeah, because I need some food. Just need a little bit of fish. And then we're going to go ahead and get our iron bars uh, set up. Um, we're going to get our, our steel. Sorry. Um, so we're going to get our iron. We need our steel. I know it's in here somewhere. Steel. Is that all the steel we have? No way. Um, I guess we need one more steel um, to do that. We need to use a little bit more of our coal. Oh, and we need the engineer's hammer. So let's get that. I'm trying to be a little bit more organized this episode, and I'm still not that organized. Um, I'm, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Uh, let's see. I thought it was in here. I, I'm like I always overlook it because it's such a weird-looking tool. Yeah, um, I'm not actually seeing it. Is it already gone? This is like one of the only ways I can find items when I don't have a sorting system. There it is. It, it was right in front of me and I totally missed it. But yeah, we gotta get this guy back. There we go. Oh, it doesn't... Doesn't accept regular coal? Does it only accept coal coke? Maybe it only accepts cold cook. I guess so. We gotta get at least one more because we need to turn these into the base of the anvil. Um, and we should be able to go ahead and actually craft our armor. Just like this. Now we have our set of armor. Now we just need to kind of empower it. Um, oh, we already have we have enough steel plates. Okay. Okay. Now we see three blocks of iron. 
And then a little setup like this. Oh, opposite. And we got ourselves an anvil now. Sweet. Now that's not the only only problem we have to, to figure out. Uh, we have an, another issue that uh, we're gonna have to figure out. And we do have ender pearls, so we can make them. But to get this empowered, we're gonna need the vibrant alloy, vibrant crystal, which is one emerald surrounded by the vibrant alloy, which is energetic alloy. So let's actually make some energetic alloy because we're gonna need it. Probably need tons of it. I'm gonna actually split this in half. 16 should be fine. I think. Um, I hope. <laughs> Anyways. Um, but yeah, let's split this up. Unfortunately, it's going to take a little while to get all this stuff. But um, I'll, I'll go ahead and cut and I'll be right back whenever we have um, our Vibrant Alloy about to be made. We've almost got enough done here. Uh, pretty sure that's gonna be fine. Um, I did some house cleaning. This guy was backed up, man. I mean, really backed up. So we have all these empty cans. Um, this is all iron, I think. I think it gets turned into iron, yes. Yeah. I don't know why this recipe is a thing. I don't really know what this does. Uh, that gives you four. And I think the other one gave you four? Yeah, I don't know why you would why you do that, but... That's a thing. It's probably just a mod conflict or something. Um, but yeah, we also have some iron nuggets here. But yeah, we're doing pretty good. We got 23 diamond now that I look at it. And we're also gaining... Or we've... we've we got this through the questing thing. So we have the emerald. So what I'm gonna do... Clear this out. Turn this back to furnace mode. Cook our emerald so we'll actually have access to... The four emeralds that we actually need. So this actually worked out just... just fine. Um, we're gonna need all of those and then four of these and we're gonna have to surround these I'm pretty sure all of these get turned Let me just double check before I actually go through with this um, the dark armor section empowered is a vibrant crystal vibrant crystal um, vibrant crystal Fiber crystal, yeah. I thought so. I'm pretty sure it was that, but just wanted to make sure before I wasted all these materials on it. So now we have four of those. And all we need now is levels. Hopefully we can get enough levels this way. Oh, you... Okay. Um, I'm gonna need something to hit this on, I guess. Because I can't do it he over here. Guess this will be fine. There we go. I hope I have enough to actually do this. Um, so let's go ahead and empower the chest plate first. Okay, that thing is empowered. And we're gonna need 10 more levels. Alright, they're at 32. I think we're gonna be able to do this. I really hope so. I really hope I have enough. Because if not, I'll be so sad. Alright, it looks like we might. So that's good. That is good. Perfect. Now we have to power all this stuff. That's another thing. And I hope there wasn't a need for this, uh, all these bottles enchanting. I hope I'm not wasting them. Come on. Not enough. Alright, um, how am I gonna do this? Let's see. I'm sure there's not a crafting recipe for them. No, there's not. Hmm. I 
I bet I'm just gonna have to go and kill some bad guys. So, alright, I'll be right back, I guess, after I go destroy and wreck some bad guys. Go ahead and get my bow and arrow and stuff, so yeah. Alright, so these guys are getting incredibly hard to actually attack, and he's got the withered effects on him. Aw. Oh. Did I just lose that guy? Alright, I don't know if I... Yeah, I'm not gonna risk that. Hey, this is the area I cleared out earlier. Um... Man, look at all the piranhas. Alright, we need to find some more bad guys. Like, I'm... I'm struggling to find them. I don't know why. Maybe I'm not, I haven't activated any beacons or anything like that, so... Maybe that's why. I think they spawn more whenever you... Um, use those beacons. But I'm not seeing any. There's one right here somewhere. Oh, we got a wolf. That was some experience. Not much. It's almost not worth it killing these guys. They have so much health. Well, this guy doesn't. Oop, we are almost at the last section. We almost have enough levels. Probably after we kill this guy. Oh, he's actually pretty easy. Perfect! Now we can head home. Sweet! So we got our 10 levels, and we're able to head right back. Okay, so let's empower the last piece. Our pants. Bam. Everything's empowered, and we should be able to move on to the next step. Um, I did notice there was a quest in here. Uh, it's not in this section. It's probably under... Oh, what's this? Oh, we get that quest again. I'll worry about it later. Um, what is it? Upgrades? No. I think it's under infrastructure. I guess it's not. Maybe it's under automation. Okay, we have power reserves. A basic passenger bank is all we need. And that would actually work out perfectly. So we could charge our armor. So we need some iron plating and basic capacitors and some redstone, a redstone block. So that's pretty easy to make. Um, we're gonna need some gold, we're gonna need some copper, and I think that's about it. And we already have the iron. I think we need four copper plates, I think it was. Four copper plates, or four, four iron plates. That should be easy enough to make. And we're also going to need everything else. Okay. These guys. We need a bunch of those. Because we're going to need these capacitors. Man, that is scary. Every time. Never fails to get you. Never fails. Okay, get back to making these guys. We only got one. We only need three at the moment. So, we should be good to go after our plates are done. And we can make our capacitor. Awesome. Now, with the base capacitor, where do I want to put this? I guess right here is fine gonna generate some RF in there and we can actually pop all of our armor and just let it sit and charge um, it should charge up be pretty decent for us uh, beginning at the moment um, if we whenever we do get 10 more it looks like 10 more levels we could pop the glider on this guy I think the glider would work nicely and then get a I would love to get the jump so 10 to get jump on this thing would be really nice. Um, and that speed boost. I don't know if they're... The speed boost is on the legs. Which gives you swiftness. Uh, or we need a potion of swiftness. So yeah, those would be really nice to get. This guy's just chugging along. It's actually out of power at the moment. I'm just feeding it cold coke at the moment. Giving it as much as I can. Because um, it's really struggling. Um, we're gonna have to upgrade our power system sooner or later Because right now it's it's just not cutting it and we don't really have a way of automating I think redstone 
I think there's a redstone way, but we don't currently have a way of farming this. And I don't know if the farmer actually works. But we do have a lot of redstone, I have to admit. This works out pretty good. Oh, also, um, I didn't know if this is what works, but yeah. You get more, um, from these guys, you get more of the ender lily seeds when you harvest them, just like you do these guys. You get more of their, their flowers as well. See, I got two red orchids from this. And this guy got broken. Probably from them guys when they broke in the base. Um, but yeah. We went ahead and we got quite a bit done. I can actually probably make um, the Vibrant Alloy Octatic Capacitors. I don't... Yeah, we, we probably can, but it's going to take a lot of crafting. Um, and at the moment, we don't really need it, but... Is... These guys all filled up? Yeah, it's just generating slowly for these guys. Just because there's no power reserve at the moment. This guy's producing as fast as it can. If I put some speed upgrades, which we'll probably get into because we can, I mean, we can do that. Um, it's not too expensive to get speed upgrades. I don't think, unless they change the recipe. But speed upgrades just, yeah. Okay, so it requires a block of redstone. Hmm. Yeah, that that's a little bit more. But, uh... Yeah, the block of redstone ain't that bad, I guess. Because so we have access to all the redstone. But yeah. Well, if you guys enjoyed this episode, please don't forget to click that subscribe button and also give this video a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. You guys are awesome. And as always, thanks for watching. <laughs>